last night we stayed at the uh, something spiritual life centers uh, baseball field. There was a, a cold shower, a pavilion, which we ended up using to hang our hammocks off of because the tree situation wasn't great. And now I'm leaving the property and there's a hill, which you can't actually tell, but um, there was, uh, I don't know, maybe a dozen or so folks there by the end of the night. We stayed in the pavilion through the rain and then set up our hammocks without a tarp. I smelled the skunk somewhere nearby in the middle of the night and heard coyotes um, call in response. This hill is kicking my butt. Um, and that's an easy, supposed to be an easy one. We have a really big day planned at almost 14 miles. Over 14 with the point four out of here. Which is our biggest day. But we're going to try. There's also an 8.4 option if we need to bail sooner. Uh, it's been good to hear names that we recognize and hear that people have been bouncing around. Um, we've gotten to the bubble part that folks left early May, late April, um, some beginning of April, but that folks are are starting to catch up to them, to us from that time frame now. So we gotta keep trying to push miles to get in what we gotta get in today. Um, or to get in what we gotta get in before Katahdin. So, uh, we will, it's like 7.30. And we're getting started, so we'll see how today unfolds. Shoot. Okay, so I just passed. I thought I was recording. It wasn't. There's this inoculation station for smallpox. George Washington used it, established it, something. You can see the foundation of the building here. Um, let me go to the plaque again. <sighs> so you can pause and read it if you want. So, smallpox pandemic, epidemic, um, inoculations. You know, get your vaccines, folks. Uh, we are making decent time today. We've been hiking just over four and a half miles. We have just under nine and a half left. We are hoping to make it to the beach, eh, but we'll see. We're, we're not making that good a time, but we might still be able to roll in before it gets too late. Otherwise, we'll pull off and find a place to camp. Um, the hiking has been just up and down, kind of up bouldery, down bouldery, and bouldery as in like smaller rocks, not actual climbs, um, that kind of stuff. So, sorry if this is a little jumbly. Um... We're, we're going to see what we can push today. Um, there's another shelter in about four miles from here, just under, which will definitely be too early to stop. Um, so we'll figure it out.
little tree frog guy. I noticed him eating things. Oh, where did he go? Right there. Oh, he's a quick one. Uh oh. Okay, bye. We just took a little break here. Um, we are not going to make it to our original goal. Um, we're going to figure out how far we're going to go. Uh, it's like 2 o'clock and we'd have like 7 miles left so we wouldn't get in until like probably close to 9 which is dark. So we're not, we're not totally in for that. Um, but we tried and we're gonna keep hiking and we're gonna be shy of 14, but you know, that's okay.